I'm going to show you what to do if your trumpet doesn't sound right. And I'm going to give you four reasons why this might be true and the solutions to those problems. I'm going to do that right now. Hi, my name is Chris Davis and I teach fundamental trumpet lessons to the comeback trumpet player. Now, the first reason why your trumpet might not sound right is because the valves are in wrong. So right here, I have a trumpet and I purposefully put the valves in wrong for this demonstration. Now, all three of my valves are in wrong and I'm gonna show you what happens when I blow into the horn. <sighs> Absolutely nothing. It's a lot of uh, feedback. It's a lot of pressure coming against me and I can't make a single sound. That's because my valves are in wrong. So I'm gonna show you the a uh, few ways to make this right. I want you to see that there is an engraving on the valve right here. It's probably too small for the camera for you to see, but it has the number three because this is the third valve. Now I'm gonna put the valve into the valve casing and I'm gonna make sure that the number three is facing me. For my trumpet, this is the proper way. All right, so that's the first thing I'm gonna do. I know now that the, the valve is incorrectly because I can see the number and I'm gonna blow in the trumpet now. Okay, so now I'm getting some sound but it's still not a desirable sound and that's because my second valve and my first valve are still in wrong. Uh, I wanna take the second valve out now and I wanna show you an alternative way to know that you're gonna have your valves in correctly. It's very simple. I'm gonna put the valve in the casing and there's gonna be a click. It's really soft, but there's a click. You can feel it and you can hear it if it's quiet enough in the room. And that's how you know the valve is incorrectly. So just listen for this. I don't know if you can hear this on the video, listen. Okay, so there was a click there. I'm not sure if it, if it went through the microphone to your ears, but there was a click there. Now, the second valve is incorrectly. Let's see how that changed the blow. A little more air is going by, going by. I can feel it, but that's still not the desirable sound. So now I'm going to turn the first valve in the proper way, and I'm going to show you a third way to check if your valve is incorrectly. And this is how, as you're putting the valve in, just blow air through the trumpet like so. I'm not getting air because the valve, the air is not passing because the valve is still in wrong. But check this out, as I blow, as I turn, you can see what happens. The air is released. So now I know that my valve is incorrectly. All right, so I'm gonna play some notes now, make sure the horn is working properly and it should be fine. We're in business, all right? So that's one reason why your trumpet might not sound right. But there's another reason why. It is the water key is open. So if your water key is open, you're gonna have problems. Um, here's the water key if you didn't know. This is the water key. So there are two reasons this might not work properly. One is that the spring just might need to be replaced. There's no more spring in the spring. The second reason is your cork might have fallen out and you didn't know it. And so therefore the hole is not being closed up. So this is what the trumpet sounds like if your water key is open. You can see I'm pressing the valves and I'm still getting primarily the same sound. So the water key might need to be fixed. That's one option of why your trumpet doesn't sound right. All right, here's the third reason why your trumpet might not sound right. Your trumpet is dirty. So that's a very easy solution. The first, the first thing I want you to do is check your mouthpiece and make just look through it. You should be able to see straight through it and there shouldn't be any dirt actually. If there is some dirt in your mouthpiece, all you need to do is get a, a, a brush and clean your mouthpiece like so with some warm water and um, some dish liquid. And that's, that's all you need to do. Now your entire trumpet might also be dirty. And so if that's the case, uh, get a trumpet 
cleaning kit like so. Inside of these of these kits, you'll find a, a brush for the mouthpiece, a brush for the lead pipe, and a, a brush for the tuna slide, and oil and grease and everything you need to care for your trumpet. All right, so your trumpet might be dirty. Check to make sure your horn is clean. Finally, if if your trumpet is clean and your trumpet is in good working order and if your valves are in correctly, there still may be a problem, which is you need to practice. Now, don't worry. All of us need to practice. If, if we've been playing for a week or if we've been playing for 20 years, all of us still need to practice. But what do you practice is the question. You need a routine. And if you don't know what should be in a routine, I'm going to help you with that. Click on the video that's on the screen right now and I'll show you what to practice and I'll be there to help you. Take care.